Hi, and welcome to 365 Fitness Tips. I'm Marty Kay. Today's topic is the honeybees and Monsanto. Monsanto has a U.S. patent 6660690. It provides the coating genetically modified seeds with chemical pesticides. Pesticides are designed to destroy plant, fungal, or animal pests. Insecticides are a substance or preparation used for killing insects. Monsanto has genetically modified seeds with chemical pesticides and insecticides. The insecticides have a protective dressing of the seed to protect the newly sprouted seed at a vulnerable time in the plant's development. Unfortunately for the honeybees, this dressing is causing them illness. These new genetically modified seeds with their protective coating are causing honeybees to become disorientated and die. They cannot find their way back home after pollinating the crop. And so with fewer bees returning to the hive, you then have something called colony collapse disorder. A side note, the queen bee is the only bee in the whole hive that has reproductive organs. The worker bees are the rest of all the women doing everything as usual. Then you have the drones, the males, and all they do is wait their turn to mate with the queen bee. Whatever. Just in case you're wondering what happens if the queen bee dies, they then elect one of the other worker bees and feed her royal jelly to develop her reproductive organs and the game starts all over again. So back to Monsanto, I was reading the article by Professor Joe Cummings called Requiem for the Honeybee. He says, neonicotinoid insecticides used in seed dressings may be responsible for the collapse of honeybee colonies. Because there have been so many honeybee colonies collapsing, it has been called the Colony Collapse Disorder, CCD. About one-third of the human diet comes from insect-pollinated plants, and the honeybee is responsible for 80% of that pollination. When industry steps out of line and it affects the whole population, people should know what is going on and not be fooled by misinformation. Here are some of the fruits and vegetables and nuts that the honeybee pollinates. Kiwis, strawberries, papayas, watermelons, tangerines, tangelos, coconuts, apples, cucumbers, cauliflower, cabbage, turnips, bell peppers, Brazil nuts, cashews, chestnuts, cola nuts, hazelnuts, and this is just a list of some of the things honeybees pollinate. Wow. So honeybees are a little bit important to our uh, you know, eating supply here. So if you want to help out the honeybees, plant a flower or garden without using the Monsanto Roundup. That Roundup actually will kill them as well too. So until next time, eat healthy every day. Exercise at least 10 minutes a day and enjoy your body and become fit and empowered with Marty K, the queen of fitness. Until next time, ding!